Aaliyah, welcome back to my kitchen. Let's continue the cake week. So I recently posted the lemon cake, yum. If you haven't seen it, click the link to see it, it's delicious. And today we're going to make a date and nuts cake. In Morocco, during Ramadan especially, dates and nuts, walnuts, almonds and any kind of nuts are very important for the Ramadan table. So imagine you take these nuts and bake them into a cake, yum. So if you want uh, the ingredients and the written recipe, don't look further, just go underneath the video in the about section, I list them there. And that's it, let's start! First, slice the dates in half. Remove the pit and cut the dates into small pieces. Next, slice the figs into bite-sized pieces. Place the dates and figs in a bowl and cover them with hot water to soften them. Let them soak while preparing the rest of the ingredients. Using a kitchen knife, chop the walnuts and cashews. You can use any other nuts of your choice, pistachios or almonds, just make sure they are raw and unsalted. In a large bowl, place the eggs and sugar. Beat at high speed with an electric egg beater for 5 minutes until you get a whitish egg mixture. Now, add the softened butter and continue beating until well incorporated. Add the vanilla extract and mix for 30 seconds. Time to add the dry ingredients. Sift the flour over the egg mixture, mix, add the baking powder, and mix until you get a smooth batter. Add the chopped nuts, mix. Finally, add the dates and figs that you drained from the water, of course, into the batter. And you guessed it, mix. You will get a thick, smooth cake batter. Let's prepare the baking pan. Butter the pan so that the parchment paper sticks to it, then butter the parchment paper itself. Pour the batter in the baking pan and even it out with a spatula. Bake on a preheated oven at 360 Fahrenheit degrees, 180 Celsius degrees for 45 minutes or until the cake gets this beautiful golden brown color. To check if it's done, gently touch the center of the cake. It should feel firm. Let the cake cool down a bit before serving. Check this out. It's the perfect cake. Soft, sweet, and crunchy. Yummy! Bon appétit!